back outside with it. My boy got a few nings and dings, but he'll be all right. We about to link up with Troy. He told me to pull up with the Jimmy Butler. Ooh, bars. We got to find us a lead blower. That, that's what they say out there. I think they call it a blower. Dude, the only option is to go ask Brian. That's the only option. I ain't even gonna lie. He ain't trying to go ask B, though. He really ain't trying to do that. But, Duda, you got to put your pride to the side, Clyde, because it's time to slide. All jokes aside, I ain't gonna lie. Your boy was just flowing just now. I ain't gonna count. All that shit wrong. Take a deep breath, brother. It's time to get her done. Yeah, he, he said he ain't doing it. This nigga walking away. Dag nabbit doodalini. Fine, we gonna do it your way. What you gonna do? Where you gonna get a ratchet from, boy? He said he gonna go to Miss Genevieve backyard. Yo, slow down, brother. You, you looking a little too suspicious. I can't stop this nigga. These big ass jeans got a mind of his own. That's her crib right chest, son. So why you wanted to come here? Oh, let me guess. You trying to put that dick in Miss Genevieve. Huh? You, you know it's all he into them big booty ebony milfs or gills. You know, 40 plus. Ooh, dude, you dirty dog. You like Ebony Mills just like your massa. That's that's me. I'm, I'm massa. We searching for whatever this man trying to look for. I don't know. I'm, I'm lost right now. <laughs> what you doing, brother? Wait, what the hell? No, no, Lucille. He don't need nobody to protect him. He didn't win and got a gun. That boy really backed out this wa da da dang, wa da da dong dang ass gun. Miss Genevieve bought this bitch from a nigga in Saint Denis. We got what we needed. Now we finna pull up on Troy or a walk up. No nigga, not trying to buy no drugs, bitch. This is not the time to get high right now. My dude just got knocked out. Man, man, shit is real. They got the big booty cheetah girls outside right now. The block is busting. Oh, they go Troy. So we need to see what's up with him, cause this nigga in all black with a ski on is confirmed. Dude getting busy tonight so troy telling duda that he got some info on these niggas that shot his crib up the shorty named jasmine told troy she might know one of the niggas that was in the car that night he was talking to one of her friends on the strip and he was bragging about it and shit you know trying to sound cool she said he'd be hanging at this little repair shop over on teller street Man, we ain't doing no more talking. We over there. They want Duda to drive. My dude ain't even got no license. And the boys right here, so we finna just wait because we got heats in here. We niggas. This my boy. First time driving damn near. He a little shaky. Look at him. Oh, Lord. Oh, that boy almost hit the bench. Jesus, take the wheel. Okay, okay, we all right. Oh, no, brother. Not the Suzuki. Man, the police came six cars deep. Helicopters and all. What the fuck that boy did? Killed the governor? Nah, I know shorty said he be by the repair shop, but we still out here scoping these streets. You know what I'm saying? We out here, we out here scoping these goddamn streets because we got to make sure because we got this heat and we trying to, um, uh, I don't even know. Because <laughs> you never know. He could have went to his grandma's house or went to pick up his uh petite Latina stepsister. Great category, by the way. Or he could have went and got some food. You heard me? We got to be cautious. We got to play it smooth. Because if I catch him at the wing spot, I'm going to punish him with this rusty ass gun and take the plate of six piece lemon pepper wings with ranch fries and eat them while he linking out the back of his binky. <laughs> I got hungry mid recording. My bad job. My bad. I was rambling. Damn. It's packed at the St. Bartholomew Theater. That's a reference. Make, make sure y'all go watch Retro Tales on my other channel. Azul 2K. Free promo. The shooby bitches is outside, nigga, and it is not a game. We're going to pull up right here in front of the hoes. Hey, baby. Oh, yeah, I see him. If you look closely, you can see three niggas posted up right there in front of the repair shop. All right, so I'm going to put this mask on, and we finna go over there and see what them Baker Street niggas talking about. What's up, nigga? And sit your bitch ass down. The fuck is wrong with him? Look at your mans. He's scared. He done ran off and shit. Put your fucking hands up, nigga. What's up? Hey, man, what, what the fuck is this? Don't act like you don't know, nigga. You know a Zam. Bro, I don't even know what's going on, homie. What, y'all trying to rob me or something? Y'all know who I am, right? Yeah, I know exactly who you with, Kush. You with the niggas who shot up my fucking house last week and almost killed my mom. Oh, you do the? Hey, man, look, I was just a driver. I told Bisky that shit was stupid. Look at you, whole rat. You done gave up your la partner, your role, and everything. Fuck them niggas' blood. Hey, look, I can show you where Bisky at. Just don't kill me, homie. I got a son. Man, get your bitch ass in the car. Go that way, boy. And you better not make no sudden movements. Or oh, I'm a... Oh, shit, they looking. What's up with y'all? This my little partner, Delroy. This is how we play. You know, he be tripping and shit. My brother, bitch, you better walk straight into that lane. Stay creeping in this little alley right here. We got to go to the spot that this little boy Kush telling us to go to. We looking for a nigga named Beesky. Duda know who Beesky is. They used to play park ball together back in the day. That's how they knew where Duda lived at. And we got the members ready to split a nigga bank I think this the spot right here, y'all. So me and Troy gonna go in here, smoke this nigga, and leave like my mama in 2000. 
thousand. We finna go in there and get street justice on these mark ass busters. We got them boys on their knees like a Bella Danger. And they talking about Beesky ain't here. Kush, bitch, you lied to me. Talking about Labiski at the trap. I mean, this ain't even no trap. This look like a nigga grandma house. Bro, you stay here and keep these niggas company. I'm finna go search the crib. You no, know, we gotta be real careful. The bathroom clip. <laughs> look at that boy in the fucking Celtics jersey. That boy look clean, but it's wee wee dirty though. I'm bugging. I don't even know why I said that. I'm a little drunk right now. Excuse me. Them Capri Suns ain't no fucking joke. We back in the way of hall, making sure the coast is clear. I don't see nothing. Oh shit! Hey, bro, don't reach. Shit! Damn, yo, bro, this nigga just smoked this nigga. I ain't even gonna lie. He reached for that bitch, son. My son Duda had to, son. Damn, nigga, Sean Figueroa with that boy, son. Duda panic and calm down, brother. Calm down. This nigga pacing back and forth. Nigga, we going to jail. Look in the stash, little brother. They probably got something in there. All right, they got 16 G's of that RG pack. That RG pack be hitting. We gonna take that off of them. And they got 5,500 in the stash. Damn, Duda, bitch, this your lucky day. I ain't gonna lie. You might be traumatized after killing this nigga. But shit, you, you might as well just take this. Go get you a pair of kick, you know, break that down with your brothers. If he can't break bread, he fake. He had 5,500 on his pl- All right, fuck it, y'all get the point. We got five bands on us right now, and we need to get the fuck out of here for the neighbors call somebody. All right, y'all, I know y'all heard me smoke your partner in the back, and y'all about to meet the same fate. Hey, bro, smoke these niggas. <laughs> you thought I was killing you? I, I only got two bullets left in your- Come on, bro, we out this bitch. Man, I thought he was in there. Man, I'm about to smoke your bitch ass. Chill out, bro. He usually be here, homie. I swear. But I could text him and tell him to meet me somewhere. Give me your phone, nigga. We told that boy meet us by this abandoned loft. He said he pulling up, so if we play this right, that nigga Beesky will be a pack in a few minutes. If y'all made it this far, type Azul went crazy in the comment section. It's getting wild right now. Waiting on this nigga Beesky to pull up. This the little nigga baby dang right here. You know he part of the foes. Hey dang, go find us a whip so we could take this bitch and burn it after we smoke this nigga. And put this nigga Kush in the trunk. Yo Troy, you ready? My boy Troy with whatever, he ready to flip some. Oh shit, I see a car. Oh, that, that, that boy go right there. And he got out the car, we finna punish him. Zan Beesky. So look, man, I'm gonna give you the choice, huh? You tell me who told you to shoot my crib up, and I'm gonna let you go. If you don't, my man over here gonna blow your shit back. Always knew Kush wasn't built for this shit. Hey, Duda, Troy, we both know y'all ain't no gangsters. Look at Troy, nigga. Got a shotgun. You wouldn't even shoot a bird in Blaine County. You soft as baby shit, homie. Oh yeah? How you figure that, son? Y'all niggas was always good boys growing up. Had all the toys and games. Yeah, nigga. I shot your house up. That was my work. I take that charge. I hope you find closure knowing I almost took your bitch ass out. Now look, I'ma get back in my car and I'ma forget that y'all pulled a gun on me. And I'ma let this shit slide. You know personally that I shoot shit. Ask your moms, nigga. You know they ain't stopped making guns when they made jaws, right? Looks to me you ain't even bring the one they made for you, son. <laughs> you too comfortable, a bitch. I did what I did because your block chose the side of the enemy. And once y'all decided to fight Deshaun at school, you and your crew was enemies in our eyes. I knew where you stayed at, homie. And I shot that bitch up. And you ain't gonna do shit about it because you's a bitch. You right, son. Troy, smoke this nigga. <laughs> Bitch ass nigga. Okay, I kept my word, bro. Just let me go. I'ma let you go. Thank you, bro. You ain't never gonna see me again in the city. I'm gonna let you go talk to God about it. No! 
Duda was a two-time demon within a matter of hours. From now on, niggas was gonna know he wasn't fucking around when it came to his family. If you with him, he'll put it all on the line for you. But if you on the other side, the shit was a scary sight. This moment right here was the birth of one of the most ruthless gangsters to ever come out of Forman Park.